the, the catch in the in the end zone. Oh no, sorry, not in the end zone. Uh, yeah, that so, one drove me nuts. Yeah, so let's. I've got a couple of replays here, so we can look at it more closely. Um, so this one is a bit blurred here, so we can't really see. But yeah, I guess Lucky was open five yards, four or five yards. Yeah. If he throws it ahead of Lucky with some air under it, a lot better chance than that one ha- than this being anything. It's a lot, mm-hmm. yeah. I mean, obviously, catch the guys like right behind him, right, right, and then yeah, yeah obviously separation on Lucky. Because that TSN camera angle was behind Hatcher, and I think that was. I don't know who the just Saskatchewan defender was, but you can see the Saskatchewan defender get both hands on that ball as soon as it arrives. Yeah. And uh, Hatcher's that... arm was in there, but not as his hand didn't roll on that ball until after they rolled out of bounds. Okay, let's see. I don't know. I, I guess so, he, maybe I, Adams had uh, thought he had more time or something because he kind of threw it really relaxed. Yeah. You see Adams here. also said in his post game that he needed to be a little more accurate. There wasn't, I mean, that's. This, a very, very small window this, there. This looks to me like a simultaneous catch. Yeah. You know, no, because Hatcher's other arm isn't in there. It, 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 it is. Well, he has got one arm. I mean, yeah. So, receivers so, catch yeah, with Hatcher's one arm these left, days. left hand is there. Yeah. And then his right hand is over here. And the ball is kind of in between both of their arms, right? But it, that, like I said, that camera angle from the end zone out shows the defender closing on that ball before Hatcher's hand gets on that ball. That's yes. I, that's the only reason. And I mean, Suter being Suter, I was just, I, I agreed with that with that camera angle. Uh, yeah, well, I, I, did, I, I would say the defender had both of his hands around the ball, but his also, I mean, but inside of his two hands was Ryan's one, I mean, sorry, oh, Hatcher, Hatcher's yeah. one hand. So Hatcher had one hand on the ball and then the yeah. Saskatchewan DB put both hands over the ball, and including Hatcher's hand. Yeah. But Hatcher only had one hand, and his second hand was coming in. Well, so, it wasn't even coming in. I think it was already there. Yeah, or like, yeah, maybe a split second. Like, yeah. you know, like it's like... If you have that carrying angle that TSN had, his second hand wasn't in until they were falling out of... And I, I think that's why the refs also call it incomplete, because neither of them had definitive possession the as re- they were falling out the, of bounds. The refs called it an interception. and the, Yeah, no, the, but I'm saying, sorry, the command, command center. center. Yeah, the command center. Because they have the better camera angle from the sideline where those, say where those, uh, those, the sound, the sound dish guy is. That's where the camera angle, plus the one from behind. Yeah. I don't know. To, to, to me, this looked like a simultaneous catch. Yeah, I agree and, with you, Roland. And in a simultaneous catch, it goes to the, to the, to the receiver. Yeah. Um, it now, wasn't, well, I'm going to have to stand. I'm, I'm not in agreement with the wardrobe choice tonight, but I'm going to have to beg to differ. I'm going to have to stand on my own. That was not simultaneous. And then, and then here the ball comes out, but but it never touches the ground. Nope. Uh, Hatcher, Hatcher was has able complete to, possession by yeah, now. He was able to kind of secure it um, to the back of his head. Okay, so here, here's another angle. Let's see if this is clearer. See, it looks to me here that the, all four hands are on the ball, right? So Hatcher's left hand is inside the, um, in, in between the two hands of the defender, and his right hand is right there. You can see the the armband, the orange armband right here, right? Yeah, yeah, and his hand is definitely, I mean, so, whether it's like two, three inches away from the ball or right on the ball, it's hard to tell from here, but definitely yeah. his hand was in, it was there. I think maybe is the Saskatchewan DB was pulling the ball away, yeah. so actually his hand got jostled away. Exactly. And then he re-engaged it. Yeah. So I mean, he still had his other hand in it. Like, does he need to have two hands? Yeah. Receivers usually catch with one hand, typically, right? 